All right, what's up everyone? Greg here, Project Unbroken. If you're new to our channel, I've been off heroin a little over eight years, methadone a little over six. I've been able to rebuild my life, health, relationships, and business. Matt, same thing, who I do Project Unbroken with. He's been off a little longer than me, and he got off Suboxone instead of methadone, and he's also rebuilt his life. Our channel is all about sharing our experience with how we did that, how we got off the heroin, methadone, Suboxone, and how we started rebuilding our life to get where we are today. So, today's topic of conversation is seeking professional advice to get off opioids, heroin, uh, suboxone, methadone, any of those things. The reason I did this video is because we just got a comment in. All right, I'm sweaty. I was in the middle. I just got done my workout, uh, and this comment came in. I was like, you know what? This is a really good topic. So a guy named Robert Richardson, I don't know who it is, but he commented on one of our videos, and he says, this is not very good info video. This is not very good info video. Maybe you meant this is not very, hold on. There's not very good info in this video. Maybe that's what he meant. Please seek professional advice of trying to quit opioids. So that leads me to the question, what is professional advice? Is it someone who has studied opioids? Someone who's a doctor? Someone who just has that doctor name in front of their name? I want to know, what do you think? I can just give you my experience, okay? I can tell you the first two doctors I went to to get on Suboxone, uh, eventually I, did, I couldn't use Suboxone because I kept failing. Maybe it was because the doctors didn't know what the fuck they were doing. The doctors I went to, at least. The first doctor gave me six eight milligram pills to take a day. Six. And I'm a little guy. I'm 160 pounds. When I was really trying to quit, and I was kind of abusing it then. I was selling them and doing all that. But when I really tried to quit, one a day was enough. Maybe even too much for me. Okay, one eight milligram pill a day would have been enough. She was giving me six. Okay, and that obviously didn't work because I would sell them, I would get dope, I would get other opioids, and the habit continued because I just wasn't on the right plan. The doctor didn't know what the fuck she was doing. The second doctor gave me way too little. He gave me a 10-day detox plan, he gave me 10 days worth, and he said, good luck. Obviously, 10 days later, you know, I got through it, started withdrawing, went right back to the dope. Okay, so my first two experiences with doctors were horrible. Their advice was horrible. All right, now eventually... You know, I, 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 Matt uh, talked to some doctors, and he got connected with a doctor that really helped him. So, yes, there's doctors out there that have very good advice. But in my opinion, you got to be very careful what you consider professional advice. And you can also compare. You know, maybe you can find a line here. What's, more, what's better advice? You know, a doctor who has studied the effects of the medicine or people who have successfully gotten off it. You know, we've successfully gotten off heroin, successfully gotten off methadone and suboxone successfully rebuild our lives and we share how we did it what's better advice i don't know uh you know you got to find that line maybe there's a little bit you can take from each and the whole point of our channel isn't look we're right take all of our advice just maybe you can pull stuff from us maybe you can take some of our advice maybe you can then bring that to a doctor and get an official plan with a doctor that i agree with all right but be very careful if you're a person that thinks that just because someone's a doctor that they have the best professional advice, you better be very careful. All right, And that's just my opinion on it. I would like to know your opinion. What do you think? So the whole point of this video is, number one, to get your opinion. Number two, if you think like this, I want to tell you, be careful. Because I thought like that, and it kind of fucked me over. All right, kind of put me in a bad spot. You know, I was really trying to get off, and I got some bad plans in place by doctors, and I failed miserably. Not to mention, there's a, there's, I shouldn't say a lot, but there's many doctors out there that prescribe opioids um, you know, irresponsibly, and that's how people get addicted. So be careful what you consider professional advice or just because someone's a doctor that they're going to actually help you. But again, there's some very good doctors out there. There's many very good doctors out there that know what they're talking about. Just be, in my opinion, is just be careful who you find. All right, Maybe... Take some advice from us, take some advice from men, and come up with your own plan. But I want to know your opinion on this topic. Let us know. Comment below. Talk to you all soon.